Hi everyone. It's October 20th, 2012. That's 10 20, 12 for those of you who are counting I don't know what. Anyway, it's October 20th, 2012. I'm Dwight Schmuck. This is the Schmuck Look. Now, we'll get into the Are You Next in just a moment here, but there's a couple other things I wanted to comment on real quick. Be done with them. You know, uh, Dole has recalled its bagged lettuce again because there's listeria found in it, which could lead to listeriosis, which I'm not sure what the hell it is, except that it's dangerous. But, you know, here we go again with you know, and this is the third time in like nine months that lettuce, for God's sakes, has been recalled. But we don't do those things any, you know, we don't regulate this stuff and inspect as much anymore because, well, the corp these big corporations will just regulate the hell out of themselves, don't you know? And they'll make sure every piece of machinery is just spotless, no matter how much that costs the corporate profit structure. And those bonuses, ah, oh, the hell with bonuses. You know, we got to keep everything safe for the consumer. Yes, I am being very cynical here and satirical. Because you damn well know that isn't true. And here again, you know, corporate personhood is going to lead to death for a lot of people that shouldn't be dead as quick as they're going to be. Because, well, the corporation can now buy an election. And it does. Another thing I wanted to talk about is, you know, the government itself. And this is the big one. This is why the RU next. The government itself. <clears throat> two state, well, a city government, one state government, and the national government are discriminating against Americans or alleged Americans, some aren't, so alleged, in Arizona it's, show us your papers, please. They have that papers law where, you know, if you look Hispanic, the cop can come up and ask you for your papers. And a lot of cops have to, you know, you got to keep those summonses up and stuff. Even though illegal immigration is down 60 to 70 percent, why, you know, and, and no, Jan Brewer, it's not because of this dumbass law. It's probably because a face like yours drives people the fuck away. I wouldn't let my dick near your mouth. I'd be terrified you'd chew it off. And that's the God's honest truth. Jan Brewer, you're a hateful, spiteful bitch whose only interest is in making sure white folks stay supreme. That's your only interest. That's called discrimination. It, sh it is illegal by definition. But you found your little way around it. And oh my goodness, you're just going to ride that forever. You know, if there's a cool spot in hell, I hope you sit three doors down from it. Right next to Sheriff Joe. <sighs> How you disguise yourselves as human beings, I'm not sure. In New York City, you know, we have the uh, the 250 summonses where, you know, you just go up and stop and talk to and frisk and search anybody. And, you know, it's like 85 to 90 percent of the people who are being stopped and searched and frisked and asked for papers again. Where are your papers, boy? There are your papers. Give us those papers. I don't normally even carry a wallet with me when I'm out. You know, some cop would ask me for my papers. He's going to get laughed at. I don't have papers. Besides, I'm usually wearing one of my schmuck t-shirts. And there you go. Here's my paper. See, it's got my picture on it. All that stuff. You want papers, I give you papers. You want respect, you got to earn it. And the federal government is doing the same thing here. Honest to God, the Defense of Marriage Act, the DOMA, the DOMA, DOMA, discriminates against those of us who are gay. 
and I ain't one, but I said those of us, because they're American citizens and equally protected under the friggin' Constitution. Now, DOMA has once again been declared unconstitutional by an appeals court. The next step, I think, is the Supreme Court. This is still costing you and me, taxpayers, a lot of friggin' money. <clears throat> In order for the government to say, you're not equal. Here's the thing, guys. Whether it's illegal immigrants in Arizona, or alleged illegal immigrants in Arizona, and suspicious-looking black and Hispanic youth in New York City, or gay people throughout America, if you give any government, or as in this case you've got a local, a state, and a federal, you give them all the power to the the power and authority to discriminate against one group, well, sooner or later, golly gee, it works this way. They're going to tie it all together. And are you next? It's really something to think about, isn't it? Are you next? I'm Dwight Schmuck. That's the Schmuck look. Peace.